Hello, hello, hello. Good evening, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Teacher, sorry. Eh, no podré encender mi cámara este, por el momento porque me están haciendo una evaluación mis compañeros de la universidad. Marcela, right? No, Daniela Jiménez. Daniela, Daniela, I'm sorry. Daniela Jiménez. Okay, no problem, Daniela. Thank you. <laughs> okay, welcome everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hey, how you doing tonight? Ready for your class? Ready for your English class? Yes. Yes or no? Yes, yes no, maybe? Yes. What's yes, up? What's maybe. up, Nancy? Are you okay, Nancy? Yes, I do. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm yes. happy to see you, everyone. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. Um, let's do a little recap from yesterday's class. What do you remember from yesterday's class? I'm sorry. Punitor. Pronunciation. Pronunciation. Um, and doesn't do furniture. furniture. Short and hands yes. word. I'm sorry. Just no. Uh, short. Just no. Short and hands word. Answer. Short answers. Just no questions. Just yes, no with questions. short answers. Ooh, I like that you remember that. I like that you remember that. Okay, in that case, let's start with um. Furniture, can you say examples of furniture? Stop. Sofa, lamp, and... Okay, wait, wait, let's go one by one. A stove, okay, a stove, yes? Stop. Who knows the plural of a stove? Stoves. 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 Okay, Stoves. next. Refrigerator. Pronunciation. Refrigerator. 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 A refrigerator. Yes. A refrigerator. A refrigerator. And plural. What's the plural? A and refrigerators. 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 It's a little difficult to pronounce. Next, next, next. Furniture. Can you say one example? Table. A? A table. A table, yes, a table. What's the plural? A microwave. Mm, tables. <laughs> What's the plural of a table? Tables. 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 <laughs> yes. Or tables. Next. Picture, a picture. A picture. Okay, class, what's the plural for a picture? Pictures. 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 Okay, okay. Next. Furniture, guys. Furniture. Bed. A bed. A bed. Okay. A bed. What's the plural for a bed? Bed. Bed. Excellent. Beds. Beds. Okay, Beds. next furniture. Next furniture. A bookcase. Clock lamp. Uh, a bookcase. A bookcase. 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 A bookcase. A bookcase. What's the bookcase. plural for a bookcase? Bookcases. Bookcase. Class, Case. what's the plural for a bookcase? Bookcases. Bookcases. Bookcase. Como libreros. Yeah. Okay. Bookcases. Bookcase. Next furniture. Bookcase. Dresser. A dresser. A dresser. A dresser. Because dresser. it's singular, you need the article a or an. A dresser. Yes? Singular. What's the plural for a dresser? Dressers. Dressers. Very well, very well, very well. Next. 
coffee table. A? A coffee table. Excellent. Remember, it's singular. A coffee, a table. coffee okay. table. Okay. What's the plural for a coffee table? Coffee tables. Coffee uh, tables. Excellent. 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 Table. All right. Thank you, guys. Uh, we also saw just no questions with do and does. Uh huh. Can you make an example using do? A question. There is table. Do, day bedroom. Do, do, do you? Do I? Do we? Do they? For example, do Edson and Jessiel speak Spanish? Yes, they do. Yes, Excellent. They do. Yes, they do. Okay. Uh, do Mayra and Sandra dance bachata music? Yes, they they do. Maybe yes, they <laughs> yes, do, huh? They do. Maybe yes, they do. Uh, do Candy, Karen, and um, Marcela cook Salvadorian food? Yes. Yes, I do. In plural, it will be yes. They, yes, we do. They do. We, uh -huh. In tu caso, si sería, yes, we do. Okay, nice. In third person? In third person? We do. Yes, they do. What is the auxiliary for the third person? Um, that, that's, that's, that's. Okay. For example, does your father drive a car? Guys, does your father drive a car? Yes, he does. Yes, he does. It's a man. It's a man, Mayra. Father. Father. So it's he. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. If the case is negative, what if it's negative? No. No? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Hey, guys, do you have pets? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Guys, do you speak Spanish? Yes, yes I, do. I do. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Yes. Do you go to the gym? No. No, yes. no, no, no I don't. No, I do. No, I don't. I'm sorry? <laughs> no, yes, I, I don't. don't. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay, okay. Does your mother like cake? Yes. Yes, yes, she, she does. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Yes. Does El Salvador have nice and beautiful places? Yes, she does. Yes, does. Excellent. Does El Salvador have trains? No, mm -hmm. no. Actually, no. No. <laughs> Yes, no, it one. doesn't. Yes. No, it doesn't. Hey, nice job. Nice job. Let me go ahead and share now with you the screen so we can um, start the class officially. I'm going to share right here. Where is it? One second. One second. Here. I'm going to share now this one. Give me one second. here okay so can you visualize my screen now guys can you see it no no yet it's loading loading yes loading. can you see my screen now yes yeah. fabiola do. do you see my screen yes i do yes i do can you see my screen Yes, I can see one. Yes, I can. Excellent. All right. You guys are very intelligent. Okay. So we're going to study this. We're going to study there is. Remember? There mm -hmm. is. There are. There aren't. There aren't. Okay. For the singular, there's a. There's a bed. There's there's a bed, right? There's a. For the plural, there are some. There are some. 
Okay. That's for the affirmative. Okay. For the negative singular, there's we have two options. There's we have two options. We can say there's the contraction. There's no there's no and the and the and the noun. Yes. Please note that yes. in this form we don't use the article a or an. Ahí no, no usamos el a o el an en esta forma, ¿ok? Solo ponemos el no más el, el noun acá. For example, no sofa. There is no TV. There is no internet. Wi-Fi. There is no. There is no refrigerator. Yes, there is no. It's negative. Que no hay. La otra forma sería usando isn't. There isn't. Ahí sí, usamos el article. Ah, there isn't a table. Yes, there isn't a sofa, etc. Do you understand? Yes. Yes? Okay. In the plural, yes. same, lo mismo. Tenemos la misma forma usando el no, right? There are no chairs. We pronounce the plural. Y aquí yes. ya no necesitamos poner ni some, ni any, solo el no, no, plus the noun, okay? There are no chairs, there are no apples in the refrigerator, there are no watermelons, okay? So, and the other option is aren't, using aren't. Ahora, si usamos aren't, necesitamos usar any, okay? And remember, the noun is plural. Chairs, tables, sofas, eh, armchairs, pictures, in plural, okay? There aren't any chairs in the living room. Let's check this video out. Let me check. Teacher. Yes. No se escucha el, el audio del, del video. No se escucha nada. Okay, one second. Mm -hmm. Let me try again. I'm sorry. Let's no try problem. one more time. Thank you. Let me know. Let me know if you can hear now, please. Let me know if you can hear. There are no chairs in the living room. Can you hear? There aren't yes. any chairs in the living okay, cool. room. There's equals there is. To better understand how to form this statement, I would like to write some formulas. For singular objects, there plus is or isn't plus a, that's the article a, or no, plus complement. For plural objects, there plus are or aren't plus some or any or no plus some kind of complement. So let's take a look at the first example on the left hand side of this chart. There's a bed in the bedroom. This is a singular object so we're going to follow the formula there plus is or isn't plus a or no, plus some kind of complement. So in this case, we use there, then the verb to be is, is. Um, on the example is contracted, as you can see, there's. We will use the article a, the complement is bed, in the bedroom. We're going to do something similar with the next example. There's no sofa in the bedroom. At the beginning of our sentence, we have there, the verb to be is, is, 
once again on the example is contracted. Then we will use the article A because we are talking about a singular object. Finally, we have the complement. Sofa in the bedroom. Let's just stop right there, okay? And so according to the formula, uh, I want you to look around where you are and I want you to tell me uh, what do you see? What do you see? Where are you right now? What part of your house are you right now? In what room are you? Are you in the living room? Are you in your bedroom? Television in the living room. You're in the living room. Okay, cool. Cool. So I want you to to use this formula. I'm going to uh, send you a chat. I'm going to send you a chat, and that's the formula that he showed on the video. Okay, which is there plus is or isn't plus a or no plus complement. In this case, we're going to make affirmative examples. Okay, so look around, look around, what, what do you have? And I need a singular example. I have a television. Can you repeat? I have a television in the living room. Yes, that is correct, Rosario, but you are not using the there formula. Is, the formula is there is. There is, uh -huh. there is a television in the living room. That is correct. Somebody else has one example for the class? There is a window in the bedroom. That is correct. There is a window in the bathroom. Very nice. Can you say one more example, class? There is a lamp in the living room. There is a lamp in the living room. Okay, okay. And how do you say how do you say foco? Because what I have is a foco. <laughs> Focus. Huh? Light bulb. Light bulb, okay. There is a light bulb. Uh, there is a door. There is a door in my room. How do you say uh, ventilador? That's a furniture. Fan. 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 Así como fan. There fan. is a fan in my bedroom. Okay, let's make a negative. We're going to use isn't or the other form, which is no. Okay? There's no. Now look around, look around and imagine something that you don't have in that room where you are right now. Something that you don't have. We're gonna say something negative. Do you have any there example? Is, there isn't a lamp. There isn't a lamp, okay. No hay, no hay lampara. There isn't a lamp. Well done, okay, next. There's no a bed. En esa forma o algo de más que sería el artículo. Sería, there's no? There's no bed. Correct. There's no bed. Yeah. Okay, podemos complementar like uh, in the bedroom, right? In my in house, etc. Yes. Can you say one more example? We're, so, we're saying negative examples. Singular yeah. negative. Me, me. In a computer, computer, pardon. I mean, computer in the office. Can you repeat that, Elsa, please? There isn't a computer in the office. There isn't a computer in the office. Yes, we need a computer very well. Uh, una chica, escuché que iba a participar? Yes. Yes, go ahead. There's no windows in my house. There's no window in my house. Very well. There is no window in my house. It's a negative example. Okay, Mayra, tiene un ejemplo? Uh, um, yes. There is not TV in my room. There is no, así como no, there is no TV in my room. Okay. There is no TV in my room. There is not TV in my, in my home. 
All right, all right. Very nice. Ahí eh, ustedes deciden qué forma les eh, favorece más. Okay, let's go with negative examples. Negative example is the, the other formula, right? We're going to use there are. Right? There are. There are no pupusas in the kitchen. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go with affirmative. Let's go with affirmative first. We're going to use there. There are. Plus some are there uh -huh. are plus some some mm -hmm. there are some pupusas plus the nouns gotta be in plural okay plural noun Plus complement. Yeah. Plus complement. Examples? There are some pictures in the living room. There are there are some pictures in the living room. Hey guys, puedo contractar there are. Puedo contractarlo. No. No. No, we cannot contract. We cannot yes, use a contraction. So así sería la formula. Aha, go ahead. We can say there are uh, for chase chain sum for a number of objects. Podemos sustituir sum por el número específico, right? Yes. Siempre y cuando usemos ya sea sum o el número en específico. Puedo decir there are 20 students, right? Específicamente, specifically 20. There are 20. 20, 20. Are 20, 20. Pues, so there are some students. Aunque there are some students, es como algunos. There are some students representa como un, ¿qué? Como un, uh, what? Like seven, eight, maybe. Okay. So look around your house and see something in plural. For example, uh, chairs. There are some chairs. There are some windows. Good. There are some windows. Alcanza a escuchar esa eh, plural. Good job. Windows. Continue. There are some doors. There are some doors in my house. Yes. Uh -huh. Somebody else? There are some. There are some, there are some cats. In my roof, on my roof, actually. There, there are, are some, some cats on my roof. There are some dishes. There are some dishes. Yes, we need to wash the dishes. Excellent. There are some dishes. Yes. Next. There are some corners in the bedroom. Correct. Dress. There are some dresses. There are some boxes. Yes, there are some TVs. There are some kids. There, there are, are some, some little kids. Flowers. There are some colors. There are some colors. There are some flowers. There are some pupusas on the table for you. You can take two or three. <laughs> uh -huh. How do how do you say hamaca in English? Hamak. Hamak. There is Bueno, ahí depende si sería en plural o singular, ¿verdad? Ahmak. Okay. Um, now, can I have one more example using there are some there are some books in my bookcase. Very nice. There are some books in my bookcase. There are some movies in my house. There we can are watch some movies. Water. I'm sorry? There are some bottles of water. There are some bottles. Yes, water. bottles. In este caso, bottles. Sería el plural noun. There are some bottles of water in my water. house. Mm -hmm. Yes, there are yeah. some cars in mm -hmm. the, my garage. Mm -hmm. 
They are are in the refrigerator. Ojo, ojo con la pronunciación. Not they, but there. There are some vegetables in my fridge. Right. Vegetables. Give me the S. Vegetables. Veggies. Puedes okay. decir veggies. Yes. There are some veggies. There are some vegetables. Yeah, there some are vegetables. some bicycles. Yes. There, yeah. There, there aren't any any rook in my house. There aren't any rook. Rugs. Rock. Rock. My house. In my house. All right. All right. Good, 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 good. Good examples. Let's go now and say negative examples in plural. Okay. Negative examples in plural. We're going to say uh, there are no. Okay. In the plural noun. Or Windows there in my aren't room. any. Quiero que traten de usar las dos formas. There are no. Y la otra forma. There aren't any. any. There are no windows in my room. Very nice. There are no windows in my room. Practice repeating that example, all right? Next example. There are, there, there are, there are no room. There are no windows. There are no windows in my house. Windows. Pared, how do you say pared? Quizás estoy construyendo, ¿verdad? Wow. Wall. 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 W A L L. There wall. are no. There are no walls. There are not. There are not. Next. There, there are. Are any flowers in my yard? Very nice. There aren't any flowers or plants in my wow. house. There aren't any. There aren't any pets in my house. There, there are any, any armchairs. In there my aren't room. any armchairs. We need to buy some armchairs. Good yeah. job. Good job. Somebody has one more example. I can check it out. There aren't any children. There aren't any children. Yes, in that family. In that family, there aren't any children. <laughs> yes, that's right. There are any children in this in this class. There aren't any children. There aren't any children. There aren't uh, any children no. in this house. No, no, there aren't any children. <laughs> nice. Good job, guys. Good job. Bueno, let's move on. Espero que puedan uh, utilizar eso uh, on a daily basis, right? To explain things. It's not only about furniture, right? It's about things in general, right? You can talk about fruits. You can talk about vegetables. You can talk about animals. You can talk about anything you want uh, as long as you use correctly. There is, there isn't, uh, there are, and uh, there aren't. Okay, let me see. We have our next objective, reading. We have a reading today. Let's check it out. Two special houses. And I don't know if you have access to this one, guys, because the, the letter, the it's kind of short, right? I'm going to take a picture, let me see. And I'm going to post it on the WhatsApp chat so you can see it because it is very uh, small. Let me try. Oh, se ve horrible. One sec. Okay. Okay, I hope you can see it. I hope you can see it. Okay. So we're going to make this, do this activity. Let me play this audio. Let me know if you can Hi, listen, everyone. okay? In this class, you'll develop skills in scanning and reading for details. Reading. Two special houses in the American Southwest. In San Antonio, Texas, 
There is a purple house. This house is the home of Sandra Cisneros. Ms. Cisneros is a Mexican-American writer. She is famous for her interesting stories. The house has a porch with a pink floor. The rooms are green, pink, and purple. There are many books and colorful paintings. Many other houses near Ms. Cisneros's house are white or beige, so her house is very different. Some of her neighbors think her house is too colorful, but Ms. Cisneros loves it. Every year, many people visit Arizona to learn about Native American tribes. Okay, wait. I'm going to um, analyze with you the first paragraph. The first paragraph, okay? It says, in San Francisco, Texas. San Antonio. It's in San Antonio, I'm sorry. San Antonio, Texas. Can you continue? There's a? There's a purple house. There's a purple house. Imagine purple. Continue, guys. Continue. This house is the home of Sandra Cisneros. Excellent. Miss, Miss Cisneros is, uh, is, a, is a Mexican American, American writer. 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 Writer is the job, right? Writer is her job, her occupation. Continue, guys. Famous. She's famous, She's famous for, for her interesting, interesting stories. stories. So she writes, she writes interesting stories for a living. Continue. Okay, porch. What is porch? What is what is porch? Do you know what is porch? Terraza. Porch. Es, es la fachada, como lo, lo de enfrente, right? Porch. Yes? Porch. The porch with a pink floor. Pink. What color is the floor? Pink. It's pink. pink. Imagine pink. the house is purple. The floor is pink. Continue. The yeah. rooms yeah. are green. green. Pink. Pink and purple. Oh, goodness. Colors pink. everywhere. Continue. There are many, there books, are many books, many books, books and in colorful, colorful paintings. paintings. You know what colorful is? Do you know? Colorful. I don't know. I don't know. Colorido. Colorido, correcto. So, colorful paintings, como, como pinturas, right? Coloridas. Continue. Many other houses are white or beige. So her house Wait. is very, it's very different. different. So many, the other houses, the other houses around are different colors, like beige, white, like common colors. But Mrs. Cisneros' house, it's totally different. Because it's purple, it's green. It's, oh my God, it's very different. Cool. So different, so, so different. So her house is very different. Do, do you like her house? Do you like Mrs. Nero's house, guys? Yes. 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 You do? Yes. Why? Why do you like it? Why do you like her house? Yes, I would like this guy. Colorful. It's, it's a little crazy house, don't you think? <laughs> the Imagine rainbow. the house like that in the in El Salvador, right? Purple, pink Green. floor. Green. Green, yellow, pink, purple. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> if you like it, you like it, right? Yeah. We have to respect. We have to respect your likes. <laughs> okay, like let's go with the colors. next one. Okay, yeah, you like colors, I know. Let's go with the next one. Most people stay in hotels, but next. some people stay Eight in years. traditional Native American homes called Hogan's. Lorraine Nelson, a teacher from Arizona, invites visitors to stay in her Hogan. It has three chairs, two beds on the floor, and a wood-burning stove. Ms. Nelson teaches her guests about Native American traditions. Okay, sorry about that. And let's check this last part. It has three 
Let's go ahead and join me on the reading. Let's go. Every year, Every year many, many people, people visit Arizona, Arizona to learn, to learn about, about, about Native, Native, Native American, 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 American tribes. 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 Continue. Most people, most people stay in in hotels. Yeah, people with money, people with money. When they visit Arizona, they stay in hotels. Yeah, some people stay in malls. Continue. But some people stay in traditional native. Native American Native homes, homes called, called Hogan. Hogan's. Hogan's. This house, this house is called Hogan. Hogan. Yes. Lorraine Nelson, a teacher from Arizona, invites visitors to stay in her Hogan. Hogan. It has three chairs, two beds. Okay, oh, on the floor, floor, of course, on the floor. <laughs> okay, and then a wood burning stove. And a wood burning stove. Okay, Miss Nelson, Nelson teaches her guests about Native American traditions. So, do you like do you like this house? Do you like the Hogan's? No, I don't. You don't. No. <laughs> What's up with you guys? What about the rest? Do you like a, a home like this? Do you like a Hogan? Yes. Yes, I do. It's interesting, huh? Yes. Very, very interesting. I mean, I mean, I mean, to to experience maybe one time, it's okay, right? It's okay. To leave? No. <laughs> To leave, no, it's not okay. It's not really comfortable. I would prefer Mrs. Cisneros' house. What do you prefer, <laughs> Mrs. Cisneros' house or, or the Hogan? Mrs. Cisneros' house. Mrs. Cisneros' house. How about yeah. you, Osmin? How about you, Karen? How about you, Anna? What do you prefer, Mrs. Cisneros' house or the Hogan? Mrs. Cisneros. Mrs. Cisneros. Cisneros. Why? Why? more comfortable it's more comfortable repeat comfortable comfortable, comfortable. it's more comfortable yes yeah, more comfortable. comfortable okay that's right and colorful right i prefer cisnero house because i like color for purple color ah okay so it's good it's 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 a color that you like also right nice because what color is your house by the way what color is your house by the way my background is color purple. Oh, yeah? Yes. What about you guys? What color is your bedroom or what color is your house? Uh -huh. Plateado. Plateado? <laughs> what do you mean plateado? <laughs> My house is, is like, um, like a sky blue. Me too. Me too? My house is silver. Silver, oh my god, <laughs> nice! All right, let's move on. Let's move on. Thank you guys for your participation. And remember, you need to complete this knowledge check as we move on these days. So, let me wait for this to load. And this is uh, lesson three, we're exactly in the same rhythm. It says we're going to study vocabulary for common jobs. Common. These are common, common yeah. jobs. Okay. Um, so common these job. are traditional jobs. Let's find out. Jobs and activities. Let's check. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to maybe take a picture once again. In case you, you, can't, um, you can't see well. I'm going to post a picture on the WhatsApp chat, okay? So you can uh, see it from there. Oh, 
Okay, there you go. So let's watch pronunciation, people. Repeat after me. Cashier. 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 Cook. Cashier. Or chef. Repeat doctor. 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 Flight attendant. Fly attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Judge. 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 Ojo ahí, guys, con esas referencias. Please. Next is lawyer. 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 Next is musician. 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 Nurse. 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 Pilot. 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 Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. Receptionist. 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 Mm, guys, si tienen uh, interferencia, please mute yourself. Repeat. Salesperson. Sales. Sales. Person. Okay. Sales. Oh, que okay. sales es como ventas, ¿verdad? Sales. 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 Person. Person. Sales person. Sales person. Security guard. Security. 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 Security guard. Security guard. Singer. 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 Waiter. 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 Waitress. 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 Waiter. Waiter. Singer. Singer. Security guard. Security guard. Salesperson. Salesperson. Receptionist. Police officer. Police officer. Pilot. Pilot. Nurse. Nurse. Musician. Musician. Lawyer. Lawyer. Judge. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Doctor. 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 Cook or chef? Cook or chef? Cook or chef. Cashier. 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 Okay, let's watch this out. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for common jobs. Additionally, you'll also practice describing the activities that different jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. One. He's a receptionist. Two, she's a doctor. Three, she's a nurse. Four, he's a pilot. Five, she's a flight attendant. Six, he's a musician. Seven, she's a singer. Eight, 
She's a judge. Nine. He's a police officer. Ten. He's a lawyer. Eleven. He's a cook. He's a chef. Twelve. He's a waiter. Thirteen. She's a waitress. Fourteen. He's a salesperson. Fifteen. She's a cashier. Sixteen. She's a security guard. Now let me write. Seven. She's a she's a nurse. She's a doctor. One. He's okay. Is your turn. Let's get started by listening. Is your turn. Okay. It's your turn. Ready? Yes. Ready. Number one. He's a receptionist. Complete, complete. Is a he or she? He's, he's a receptionist. He's a receptionist. Repeat a. Uh, I want to hear the a. Uh. He's a he's a receptionist. He's a receptionist. Okay, what about number two? She is a doctor. She's a nurse or doctor? She's a doctor. She's a doctor. Repeat, she's a doctor. She's a doctor. And? She's a nurse. She's a nurse. Repeat, she's a nurse. She's a nurse. She's a nurse. She's a nurse. Number four. He's a pilot. 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 She's a pilot. She's a flight she's, attendant. She's a flight attendant. She she's a flight attendant. 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 She's a musician. She's a musician. Correct. He's a musician. He's a musician. Excellent. He's a musician. He's a musician. He's single. He's a singer. She's a singer. She's a singer. 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 She's a singer. She's a singer. She's a singer. Singer. She's a judge. She's a judge. She's a judge. She's a judge. Remember, judge. Complete. She's a judge. She's a judge. She's a judge. She's a judge. She is a judge. She's a judge. He is a judge. He is a police officer. Good job, Candy. Andy, um, he is a police officer. He is a police officer. He is a police officer. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. Very well. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. He's a chef. He's a chef. Or a cook. He's a cook. He's a cook. He's a cook. He's a chef. He's a waiter. A chef. He's a, he's a waiter. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. Repeat. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. Waiter. He's a waiter. Waiter. A waiter. She's a waitress. Waitress. 
waitress. She's a waitress. The man, waitress. waiter. Waiter. And the lady, waitress. Waitress. She's a waitress. She's a waitress. She is a waitress. She's a waitress. Pronunciation. He's a sales person. He's a sales person. He's a sales person. Person. Sales person. He's a person. He's a cashier. She's a She's a person here. Okay. She's, She's a, a cashier. cashier. She's a cashier. Very nice. She's a cashier. 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 Security. Security. Security guard. Security guard. Security guard. Security guard. Security guard. In a hospital, in a, in a store, these different jobs do. Places, in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. Activities, wears a uniform. Sits all day, talks to people, works hard, stands all day, handles money, works at night, writes tickets. Okay, repeat, guys. Wears uniform. Wears a uniform. Wears a uniform. Wears a uniform. Wears a uniform. Sits all day. Sits all day. Sits all day. Sits all day. Talks to people. Talks to people. Talks to people. Talks to people. Works hard. Works hard. Give me the works. Porque vamos a hablar de él o de ella. Okay. Works hard. Stands all day. Stands all day. Stands all day. Stands all day. Handles money. Handles money. Handles money. Handles money. Handles money. Walks. Works. Works at night. Okay. Works. Works, works at night. Works at works night. At night. Writes tickets. Writes tickets. Writes tickets. Writes tickets. Repeat. Writes tickets. Writes tickets. Writes tickets. Works at night. Writes at night. Works at night. Works at night. Handles money. Handles money. Stands all day. Stands all day. All day. Works, hard. Works hard. Works hard. Talks to people. Talks, Talks to people. people. Sits all day. Sits, Sits all day. day. Wears a uniform. Wears a uniform. uniform. Do you have any question on these activities? Handles. What is the meaning of handles? Es como manipular dinero. Trabaja con dinero, por ejemplo, cashier, right? Cashier. Mm -hmm. Handles es manipular. Puede ser handles money, puede ser handles a problem. Yes. Handles a job. Eh, manipular, manejar, controlar. Ya, yeah? todo eso significa handle. Okay. Handles money bank. Okay. Uh, sits all day. Like sits all day. What is sits all day, guys? Sits all day. Sentado, sentado todo el día. Todo el día. Pasa sentado todo el día. Y stands all day. 
Parado. Parado todo el día. Ok, ok, ok. Let's continue. Sounds, right. sounds only... right. Tickets. Okay. Now, we want to connect the job to places and activities. Let me make a couple of examples and then I would like for you to make your own. A doctor works in a hospital. This is place. A doctor works hard. This is an activity. A cashier works in a store. Cashier works in a store. This is a place. A cashier handles money. This is an activity. Okay, so what you have to do is you need to say, uh, describe place and activity, right? As you see, a doctor works in a hospital and a doctor works hard. Place and activity. A cashier works in a store and the cashier handles money. Yes? Can you, can you say something about a teacher? Can you say something about a teacher? Can you describe place and activity? Teacher works in the school. Work in, in her, his office. Correct, correct. Works in a school or works in his office. Okay. Now, activity. A teacher needs a leg work. Uh, work sit all day. No, all day. No. Teacher works hard. A teacher, teacher works hard. hard. Very well. Very well. Okay. How about um? How about um? A manager. You know what is a manager? Como representante sería. ¿Saben cuál es el trabajo de manager? A manager works. Es el gerente. Es el gerente. Es el jefe. Manager in a bank. Okay, repeat. A manager. A manager works in a works bank. A in a bank. Okay, that's the place. And what is the activity? Administration. A manager. A manager. A manager hand, handles people. Handles Doctor. people. Yes, handles people. Manipula, maneja. Right, maneja, dirige, gente, handles, people. Right, excellent job, guys. A student, a student, place. A student, a student sits for eight Studies <laughs> in a school. Okay, vaya, si ustedes lo dicen, vaya. A student sits all day, está bien. ¿Qué más? A student learns in a school. Yes, a student learns in a school. A student mm, do, do the, the a student goes to school. A student, a, veamos ese, ese example. A student does, hace, ¿verdad? Tercera persona. A student does his or her homework. Okay. What about um, a chef? A chef is a different food. Or restaurant. Works in a restaurant. In, a, in the kitchen of a restaurant. Yes. Uh, chef works in a restaurant. And it's time to go, guys. Thank you for your attention. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. bye bye. See you, sweet dreams. See you. Bye bye. The same to you. Bye. Great job. Bye bye. Bye. bye.